The philosophy behind Thrust SSC was pretty clear. Build a car to take the world land speed record beyond Mach 1. To provide enough power, Thrust SSC was fitted with two Rolls-Royce jet engines, providing the equivalent of 110,000 brake horsepower. What's less well known is that a rocket motor was also fitted to the finished car. Although the design and progress of Thrust SSC took place very much in the public eye, one or two things were kept secret until after the supersonic record was achieved and Craig Breedlove's challenge had been beaten. As aerodynamicist Ron Ayres said at the time, we did have a competitor, so it seemed prudent to keep some things secret until we had won. Whilst Thrust SSC's highly publicised active suspension was specifically designed to stop the nose of the car lifting at speed, during normal running, it would be of no help at all if the car hit something, for instance a rut on the course, whilst running at speed. If that happened, the nose would lift very quickly indeed, leading to a huge accident which might destroy the car and seriously injure or kill the driver. I spoke to Ron Ayres after the team had returned to the UK in 1997, and he described the solution they came up with as a smack on the nose. What was needed was a way of instantly adding a huge amount of downforce to the nose of the car if it should lift. What they used was a rocket motor. A solid propellant rocket motor from a Martin Baker ejector seat was mounted in the nose of the car, linked to attitude sensors. If the nose started to lift, the rocket motor would instantly fire and in just 10 milliseconds an additional downforce of 3 tonnes would push the nose down, loading the front suspension. Take another look at this photo of Thrust SSC. Note the yellow and black hashed lines. This is where the rocket motor was located, set to fire upwards and push the nose down. It was a pretty extreme safety measure, and in the end was never used, but in Ron Air's understated words, like many of our safety devices, it was an important insurance. If you've enjoyed this video, Please subscribe and check out Scarf and Goggles for more tales of record breaking. Until next time.